Look at this. I got a firmware update for this camera. But I'm recording. So now I click install. Install. You click install. Can you read this? Install. And then it says it can't do this while it's recording. Did you know that? This is crazy, right? So I have to turn this off and I see you with the next firmware then. Look at that. This here is a new DJI power bank generator kind of situation. So you can turn this thing on here. Yeah? Beeps, and then you can see a charge 99%. It's no energy going in, no energy going out. We are going to oh, an airplane. See it fly in there? Okay, so this thing can be charged uh, two different ways. One, you can put uh, 110 in here and charge it from 110. There. And when you charge it on 110, you can charge it slow or fast, 600 watts in or 1200 watts, depending what your outlet is providing. Sometimes, in, like in hotels, you don't have 1200 available, so fuse blows there and then try 600. Okay, so that. Mm, then you have an AC generator where you can make 110 AC, and then here you have inputs and outputs both. Um, that's where you charge your um, drone batteries if you wanted to. Okay, now you can also charge this thing with the solar panels. But if you want to charge with solar panel, that costs extra. There is no connector here to put a solar panel in here. So what you need is this. This is a solar panel adapter, basically. MMP charging device. It has this special connector on here and it comes with those two brackets you can screw on here and then you can screw this thing in here here for example but when you do that then you can't carry it anymore because your hand doesn't fit underneath here so why do they make it that high why not down here they do because what you can do is you can use two of them so let me show this to you while the airplane is flying by, I'm going to put some screws in here. And I screw this on here so that I don't lose it. Where's the hole? There. So, this is like, I don't know what the price was, I think $65 for this. This is expensive. That's the price of a solar panel nowadays. Okay, so, you put that in there. Or two of those. And then let me show you. In here you have those connectors. You know those from your old drone batteries. XT60 connectors. You have three of those. So that means you can put three solar panels in here. One, two, three. If you have two of those, you can put six 100 watt solar panels on there. Okay, and, and here, you just open one of those slots. And you plug this crazy connector in there. Look at it. So you put that in there. And now you can put solar panels in there. And we see how that works. Let me show you what I have here. My temporary setup. So I just have two here. I could put a third up. But I am already 99% charged. The solar panels have those crazy connectors. As you can see here, that's what the solar panel has. So you need extension cords from the solar panel. Yeah, look at this. You have to buy that extra. To XT60. Solar panel to XT60. Let me put my generator there. 
Yeah, it's still running. Power is on. <laughs> Look at that. So, we do not have much sun, a little bit, and the dark is standing in front of it. Doesn't matter. Here, two. Plug one in here. There, plug one in here. There. And now it's going to display how many watts both of those generate right now. See, they do 50 watts right now. It's not much sun right now. Both of them together do 50. Okay, then if you need power here, so if you need power, you just plug in your power, click on the AC that lights up. They both have 110 now. I use that here for my lights. See those night lights, disco lights, LED? Okay, so those disco lights need 30 watts. Okay, sun right now provides 24 watts, that's fine. At night we won't have this input from the panels. And then we have 99% battery. So this will go 30 hours with this load. So way overnight, keep the light on at night. <laughs> But yeah, so what they don't tell you when they sell you this uh, device is that you pay extra for this, for the MPPT charger attachment. Um, you can put two on there. You can only put 100 watt panels on there. You can't put more than 100 on there. There is a limit about how much voltage you can feed. So you can't run them in series. You have to run them parallel. And... When you put the second box up here, the fan then is blocked. That's another story. But yeah, you can put six panels on there. That's going to be uh, nice. All right. Yeah, that's what I wanted to show you here. And uh, there will be more videos to come. You'll see how this thing works out.